today I'm going to show you how I make flaxseed gel. The things I used, electric pot, wooden spoon, empty honey bottle, large cup, large bowl, foot size, pantyhose, flax seeds, and water. I bought most of this stuff at Walmart. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so you start out by pouring approximately one cup of flax seeds inside the pot. Add approximately two to four cups of water. Now you just use your judgment. The more flax seeds you use, the thicker the gel will be. Continuously stirring, let the flax seeds boil for five to ten minutes about five minutes at this point so I let it boil more the mixture is ready once it has formed a slimy foam texture so that's what you want you want that kind of gooey -ness happening <laughs> turn off the heat and let it cool in the same pot for one to three hours it's been three hours and look at this guys all right now I'm preparing the pantyhose bands I like to double up because <laughs> this cost me about 50 cents I, I place the pantyhose over the large cup pour the thickened black seed mixture into the large cup this takes a little time but as you can see the uh, black seed gel is already the consistency I prefer so I just it just I love it it's perfect it's only a few flax seeds that came um, out with this <laughs> but I'm okay with that There's very little flaxseed gel to drain, as you can see. And look at this, guys. Awesome. Ah, gooey. Yes. All right, now I'm pour all the flax seeds and remaining mixture into the large cup and proceed to drain the mixture. Love it. You can reuse the same black seeds for another mixture, up to you. I like to use fresh seeds every mixture. So, this is it. The black seed gel is complete. Yes, loving it. Carefully pour into a container that can be sealed and refrigerate. I like to make a new mixture every two weeks because I don't use any preservatives. So, yes. That's it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hope it helps. Goodbye.